can't condone you know the, the, the fans entering the, the field but I have to be totally honest I can understand their emotions you know they're um, they just beat their local rivals twice in a week and once in the quarter final of the FA Cup so the emotions are running very very high but like I say the club wouldn't condone that sort of action especially if anyone was touched I, I was unaware of that Let's talk about the game and then we'll talk about that afterwards what can you do? I mean, the stewards done their best. I saw on rugby tackling a few guys, but when they're when they're coming on in such numbers, you know, it's uh, difficult to uh, to stem it. I'd, I'd run off as soon as I possibly could. You know, I had to get off down the touchline very quick because um, I'm not that quickest these days. You know, so it's made. Um, I would love to have still been out there with them. But, you know, Villa should look at the steward, and you know, there's no way in a million years those supporters. It's a it's a quarter final of a, an FA Cup. It's a full house. And you know that, you know, it's going to be tasty. Let's put it that way. Mm. You know, so, you know, you're going to, you know, obviously, you should have stewards. The, the hierarchy at Villa should recognise that you need stewards both ends, both ends of the pitch. Um, but to see the, the support was coming on with three, four minutes to go, you know, but they were congregated in the, in the, in, on the ends anyway before that time. Yeah, it puts players at danger and, and you don't want to see that. We, we were seeing that in the 70s and 80s. We don't want to go back to that. Both sending us were harsh, to be honest. Um, you know, we've come here twice in, what was it, four days. Um, Hutton should have been sent off in the week. Doesn't get sent off in the week. He gets the crossing that, that uh, uh, Foster spills, costs us a goal late on. And then today, you know, really and truthfully, uh, yeah, that's not sending off. Yak has three touches before he blows up. So he's actually won the ball, touch, touch and touch. And then he, initially... I thought the linesman had said, you know, something. But apparently, I've spoken to Anthony, he says, no, he's made the decision. Don't know what the, what Grealish got sent off for. I haven't got a clue. I was absolutely amazed when he showed him the red card. But, you know, but someone said he'd been booked previously. I didn't even realise he'd been booked. So, you know, I was absolutely amazed. Dumbfound. And the second half, they played how I wanted them to play in that shape. And, and we saw that with Scott Sinclair, you know, finding a little bit of room, penetrating more and, and showing his real class to uh, to finish the second goal. I thought we were a better team first half. Um, and then second half, we, we really got stretched on a throwing down in their half, deep in their half, which we haven't done all season. Um, and they score and then it's a different game. We have to open up and chase the game a little bit. And they, they you realise and recognise with the pace they've got on the break. And Delph breaking from midfield as well, they are going to create more opportunities and chances. But you have to take that chance. Even if we were to win the FA Cup and get relegated, it would be a failure this season. Uh, when is the draw? Monday night. Any, anyone, anyone will do, as long as it's um, Bradford. It's happened. I'm, I'm, I'm more concerned about you know, the, you know trying to stop it before it happens rather than when it did happen. Okay, thank you. Cheers, Tony.